Yeah. Okay, baby, where are we at? We are at. I think it's called Park, Park Grocery, Grocery Bait and Tackle. Okay, what are we getting? We're getting worms. So. And. And. Bobbers. And. Hooks. What else? There's one more thing you're forgetting. Crickets. We're gonna try these this time. I will not be touching the crickets. Okay. <laughs> I do not like crickets. They're like, like grasshoppers. Like they they shouldn't work a be little able, better though. They're like grasshoppers. They shouldn't be able to jump that far without running. Would you not think they'd work a little better since they, they're all at the top? We're still gonna try them. Okay. We're gonna try them. That's okay. not bad. No. But I feel like the snacks and drinks is what cost the most here. The bait is cheap, yeah. but the snacks cost the most. Yeah. Okay, baby. So we're going to Booker Tino. Yes. To fish at this little dock. We'll see everybody there. Peace. Okay, baby. So we made it to Booker T. Yeah. So now we're gonna go down to the little dock and see if we can just catch something. More than some little dinks, right? Yes. Hopefully, we catch Those some crappie. Those little things are loud. Yeah, we got the crickets and worms. So, see y'all down there. Peace. You want to start down here this time? Okay, so she's down there. I've come back up to the top to try to cast it out there. Seems like nothing's wanting to bite today at all, so. Just throw it back out there, throw it down here on the side, see if I can get something. I really like sitting in them next to them poles. So, hope we can get something. Oh, oh yeah, there we go. Got me a baby. This one's huge. Look at this guy.
don't know what kind of fish he is. Looks like a bluegill crappie mix. Let's see if I can hook out his lip. There we go. There you go. Peace, little buddy. Now we're gonna go to the trail. We got everything put up. We'll see y'all over there. Peace. Okay, so we made it to the trail. It was, it was on the other side over there. We just drove down this trail. Well, a little road to the other side. Little baby's got her goldfish. It's just a big, yeah, it's something you find in the middle of the woods, like a, like a cult. They'd be conducting rituals out here in this little circle. Amphitheater foot. Traffic only. Left. Right. You want to go this way? Okay, we'll go this way. I don't know, this way looks kind of better in my opinion. <coughs> well, <laughs> not even a few seconds down. We Cut to another crossroads, baby. Do you want to go that way, or do you want to go that way? That way leads back to the car. But this way leads further into the woods. <laughs> These wooden benches. These wooden benches. Yeah. I guess... Those were there whenever they first made this trail, I guess. It's really old. The road's right next to us. There's the, the curb sign right there. Yep, we have a car. Oh, another little bridge with water in it. It's really clear and it has little rocks. That way. Well, we're going this way. Yeah, it looks like you'd ride a bike definitely right here. There's a couple of trees that have numbers on them, like 13. We yeah, that one back 14. there added one on it. I don't know if they're mile markers or. I'll probably let you know, like. Yeah, I'd say they're mile, they have to be mile markers.
Looks like something with lightning or old age broke it. But we are at eight. Well, baby, looks like we made it back to the water finally. Well, part of the water. A part that no one's probably at. Let, hopefully, <laughs> not luckily. So, we we're at, we did interlude two, which is 2.2 .2 miles, and this is the outer loop trail, which we, we're probably gonna do that one on the way back. This is at least the outer loop. Uh -huh. Oh, so that one trail you took the other day, it would have led yeah. you here? So where we, where, it, where it goes up like this and back around, that's where it gets the slope down at. Nice. So if I would have kept running, I would have made it to the water. That's going to be awful. Oh, there. Oh, so that's it's over and around? So this yeah, is way old. behind our house. Yeah, so that row behind our house, mm -hmm. run down. If I if I run down where the baseball field is, is that row that goes down? There? This is down towards back that row. That row goes to a dead end. This is where the city's all at. Oh, so this is near that baseball field still. Yeah. Baseball field is way over there. Yeah. Nice. It's really nice out here though today, ain't it? Though. There's not a. Well, there's some clouds way back there though. But still, so it's sunny and it's starting to get warmer outside now. Yes, ma'am. And it is what time is it? It is twelve fifteen. So we've been walking for about an, a little over an hour. Maybe maybe an hour, close to an hour. It's really nice out here, though. So now we're going back, where you want to do the outer loop this time? Yeah. Okay, so there's an outer loop that way, but we're going to do this outer loop this way. This is nice. So we can't, we can't ride bikes here. Oh wait, no, or does that mean no electric bikes? I think it's electric bikes. Mm. Okay, so we didn't pass this on the way here, did we? <coughs> no, we didn't go that way. This one's green. This, Uno, this is it. This is inner loop one. We was on inner loop two. So now we're on outer loop. We just want you going that way. Peace. Oh, I'm gonna turn them up. So we are here. We was at the little point. We went on. We went on the out, we went on the inner one. This is where the dock is. Okay. So we went from all the way, and we went started from inner, we started, lots well, the road. Yeah, we went on the outer. Yeah. We just went on like a different trail we out started, here. Yeah, we started. Yeah, we, we went on inner one. Yeah, we went on inner one. Yeah, we, we did like multiple different trails, but. We're on still the outer loop. 1.2. Baby. This tree looks like a little man made toilet. Like you'd just be coming up and you just poop in that tree. <laughs> little poop tree. <laughs> 
It's a lot of these purple flowers. Yeah. It's a lot more on this side. I haven't really seen these. The car is way over there, and we still got to go uh, all the way down this trail, way down, back around, on the other side of the, the river bank, over that way, back to the car, that way. So you the water gets up higher when the water goes up? Well, I wonder if this little footbridge here uh -huh. connects to the one that the we've gone one before. Or... But it's just further down a little bit where yeah, the so stream I'll ends. The down. Now, I'd say you might catch something here down there. Because it's say not really many people come down this part. Yeah. Well, people that are fishing. So now oh, we know where we're at. That was, right there was the trail we walked on earlier and led down there. But we was on that trail up there. It follows that right there. Now we're on, back on the outer side and not all the way around the lake. So we basically went all the way around the island, right baby? Yeah. All the way around. This goes a pretty long ways. It's part of the Tennessee River. Yeah, it all connects to the Tennessee River eventually. Somewhere, at some point, it does. Booker T and Harrison Bay are just the name of the park. Yeah, it's just different parks. And looks like two different trails here. You want to go to the upper or lower? We're at mile one now. So we started at the wrong end. Where are we at? Right here. Oh, so we, we started over in here somewhere. Yeah, we started over here and went all the way around the outside, down and around. Eagle Eagle Project John Level 3 2022. We're going to get food where? At Jersey Mike's. And then we're going to do what? To the park, the Heritage Park, to play Pokemon Go because it's almost bag on community day. Bag on community day. We did 4.3 miles. We did 4.3 miles with 10,238 steps. So we'll see everyone there. Peace. Okay, baby, we made it to Jerry's Mike's. 
to get? Sammy. And then? We went to the park to play Pokemon Go. For the bag on event? Yes. You gonna get? Community day. Are you gonna get a shiny? I hope so. Before me or after me? Hopefully after you because I already got one this week. Okay. I got that man team. We'll get her Sammy and then go to the park. Peace. We got the Sammy. Yeah, they put some made on him. It's okay. Got the Jersey Mike sub. We just gonna munch and then play Pokemon Go. Now. I found the shiny. Nice, baby. It's a green one. It's a green bag on. Hopefully we at least find you one now. Found it while we was eating. You gonna name him what? Bilbo. Bilbo Baggins. Bilbo Bag on. Oh. <laughs> That's the first shiny of the community day for Bag on. Now we're gonna finish eating and walk around to a root. Peace. Cash cans full for once. Uh, okay, so we're doing the heritage loop starting at the rules. Yes. And now we commence the bag on hunt. Near to me, hi. Hello. Hi. Still no shiny bag on? I only found one shiny Bilbo bag on. But hopefully we get more. There's the little pond lake. Eh, little pond, I guess we'll call it. It's rose a lot more since the last time we've been here. It went up a little more than the last time we came too. Finally! Oh you got one? I ain't gonna be able to see it though. But you got a shiny though? You can't. Okay, so I have been invited to a Cortana raid, I believe that's what it's called. This one didn't have them as a friend. So she's not invited, but I will trade it to you if I get it. Hopefully I get it. I mean, there's five of us. I mean, we're slapping it, baby. We're... Thanks, baby. They're doing more than me. But as long as I'm in here, I'll get it. <laughs> There's my first one down. Bless me, baby. I got 13 more. 12 more. And I got a great throw. But this is always the hard part. I got it. Yes. The new legendary that, uh, well, Mythic Beast, I think, Ultra Beast, Ultra Beast, they didn't have. And it is a three star. Okay, so let me exchange my gifts and then we can. Let's add a little oddish sticker. Okay. So, exchange the gift. Where did this one come from this time? This one came from Switzerland. Nice. Let's see what Switzerland has to offer. Same stuff. Okay. Spin that, and now you completed the route. Yeah. Make sure there's no Zygarde cell chilling. Okay. Yeah, since we got the shinies, we're gonna go over 
to the little bridge way back there to go toss the poles in and see if we can catch some more bluegill. Or there's a lot of stuff in this little, little lake, little river. Uh, it don't matter. We can go anywhere and try, baby. But I'll see you all there. Peace. So we got the worms, and we got the crickets. We got the poles. Now we're gonna go over to this little bridge and see if we can, I mean, there's some pretty decent size ones in here from the last couple times that we've been here. But we're gonna see if we can catch at least something, something. And if not, move to a different spot further down where no one really goes. Peace. So this little guy is number two for me. And did you just catch one too? <laughs> so that's number one for you. And number two for me. Open your mouth. There we go. He's pissing on me. As you speak. Another little dink. Drop him back in the water. And let him go. It's number three. Peace. <laughs> Literally, not even a minute later, I caught another one. This guy is bigger than the last one. Come on, come out. Quit squirming, bro. You wanna go back home? Or do you wanna sit up here with me? Okay, I can show y'all. This is dink number four. Back in the water he goes. Sorry. Sorry, little buddy. Dink number five. Three. So while she's over there fishing still. <laughs> I'm gonna check my Pokemon Gill. Still no other shiny bag of lens. Or anything. Nope. Well. No. Okay. Well, I guess we're gonna go to a different spot or see what she's talking about. Then go to a different spot. Peace. Where are we gonna go now? We're gonna, we're gonna go try the pond, and if we don't catch nothing at the pond, do you wanna try the river? Okay, I caught them four, but. Okay, so we made it to the little pond, and it has somewhat, water somewhat rose, and I just heard something jump. That's why I stopped, but we made it to, I chose to go. The dumb way, because my fishing rod is getting stuck on everything. Oh, you finally, you finally got one. This is, that is a pretty good one, baby. I threw it and they told you they're in here. Oh, sorry. What number is this for you? Two. Two for you and five for me, I believe. Yeah. A little dinky. <laughs> they got me wet. That's my job. You want me to get them all? You may have to. To use now, crickets. They're the best thing for fishing now. <laughs> well, for these little bluegill. Chill out. So this is number three. She caught another one, but he fell off. Yeah, this is four. I forgot about that one. Yeah, that one fell off and it literally. Let me get it. Did it swallow it again? I think it did. Hi, Sammy. I caught me a bass. Lucky. The first bass that I caught whenever we went out together to fish. It's not a little, it's a little big guy.
fish. Oh god. I got it on camera. Nice. <laughs> Didn't want to do that. So now we're gonna try directly on the other side to see if we can get any more. I mean, it's a pretty good spot. They're biting like crazy, aren't they, baby? I did not expect to catch a bass at this little pond. I mean, it was. Yeah, once we we came here almost a month ago and it was completely empty. Okay, so I believe that I am going to throw out here in this little empty crevice. And then she's over there. Uh, if you want to, I didn't, and this one ate it. This that is number, pretty. yeah, this one's number six or number seven for me at the little lake. A little dink. Let's release him. Oh, there he goes. Got my whole arm and sleeve wet. He said he got my whole arm and sleeve wet. It's okay. A little feisty bastard. Think number seven or number eight. This is number eight or nine. I think it's eight, but we got another little dink. Time to release him and put him back. So you got another one. This is number five, five for you, I believe. A little jumper, a little jumpy fish. She almost caught a bass right in front of us too, about right there in the edge of all these grass. Yeah, that thing was huge. And if you all the way down there, at the nice a little shell cracker it looks like. But all the way at the end of the water down there at that little tube, right down there. Uh -huh. I seen them again because they made a big ass splash. Oh, but that was number five for you. Yeah, okay. Number five for her. Okay, baby. So, <laughs> what do we decide to do today? Oh, not today. Now. Car for a second. Yes. Walk to Brewster's to yes. get either a drink or a snack. They have ice cream. Yeah. Uh, or a slushy. Or a slushy. Uh, and then we're gonna go back to the car, get you the bobber off of the other pole. Yeah, it broke off on stick. And then go and back to the pond to fish more. Yeah, because there's some actually really, actually really big. Bites there. Yeah, we're getting pretty decent oh, bites. And she almost caught a huge one. There's no lie there, cause I at least caught I caught a bass. So the hook came off. just the hook. Yeah, her hook just came off. So did that? Did I tie that one? I tied it. So she might have not tied it good but enough. I tied it the same way I watched you tie it. That's why I was confident in tying it, cause I kept watching how you do it. Well, I don't do it the best, so <laughs> that's how Dad taught me. We'll see y'all there. Peace. Look at this cool little bridge. Mm -hmm. Roosters. Poker Sprite. A pina colada freeze and a water. I got a coke because I'm thirsty. Okay, so what did you get? Pina colada freeze. Pina colada freeze. First impressions. It's good. Let me try. Lemony, need some coconut. 
really lemony. Almost sour. Lime, not lemon, no, a lot of lemon. Well, citrus. Citrus, lime, whatever. It's pretty good though. Okay, baby, you got your drink, both your drinks. I got my Coke. So now we're gonna go back back to the pond to see if we can catch that big ass bass. Peace. What number was this one? I think number six for you. Bite it. Number six for you. Nice, baby. Yes, baby. So, number seven. Behind me by one. Camera's already on two. Thanks. Can I just cut this in front? Mm -hmm. Wanna do a double release? Probably. This is number eight for you. Number eight for my baby. It's another little bluegill. <laughs> Just Can you stop? You're jamming that damn hook in my finger. You want me to get it in? Get that. You're gonna have to use your hands. How did you get it? Yeah. Never mind. She got it. So this is nine. nine. Eight. Number eight for her. Somewhere he's out right there. Big ass napping turtle. Put my glasses on the lens so you might be able to see him a little better. Come on, float to the top, little dude. Wish he float to the top. As soon as I stop recording, go. Okay, he is. Right there. He is about to come up. It's as far as this little camera can zoom in. Look for something. People are gonna get it. Okay, so I just threw in the first time in about 10 15 minutes on a worm this time. And I caught another dink, so that's number 10. I caught one off camera, but I got him dirty and tried to wash him off. And this is number, uh, nine. number nine for you and number 10 for me. There's something inside of him, baby. See it? Huh, there's something on this fish. Isn't that he's supposed to put his fin there? Yeah. That's his fin. Yeah, his fin's messed up. Do you want me to get him off or you want to get him off? I hold him. 
Nice. Let me see. This is number nine for you yes, and number ten for me. I will hold the rod. Well, it's been uh, about ten minutes, but I finally caught another one. This is number eleven for me. Release him and let's go. Okay, baby, what number is this for you? Ten. Ten for you and eleven for me. Nice. Oh well, you got off pretty easily. Stop. Stop. So this is number ten for you. This one's a little chunky. I'll release him for you, baby. This is number eleven, right? Yep. So now we're both tied with each other. You swap to a worm now. <laughs> so number eleven, that one has some stripes. So that is number twelve. Nice, babe. Okay, she is officially beating me now. So, it is now 7.14. We've been fishing for a while. I think since 9? I think. But, she's beating me. What we're going to do as much fishing as we can until it gets dark or we have to leave. But, we're still counting the timer to see who wins. We still got some daylight left. We'll see who uh, catches more fish before the daylight is over. We're almost tied, 11 to 12. We'll see y'all if, if we catch another fish or if we have to leave. Peace. I just caught number 12 for me, so. Yep. Okay, baby. So, how many fish did we catch in between us? I caught 13, he caught 14, so 27. Okay, so I caught one more than you. Yes. So now, is the park is now closing, and we're going to go get food and maybe play pool. Yes. Hopefully. Peace. All right, so we went back to the car, and this is the end of the video. So, thanks to everyone that actually watch this far and actually watches the videos so peace everybody thank y'all i won this time see y'all in the next one peace